to all of them! Don't let any of them get away. We'll secure the castle. You just get to their master. The Dawn Guard! Skyrim! Serana, my darling. I see you still favor keeping a pet. You know why we're here. Of course I do. You disappoint me, Serana. You've taken everything I provided for you and thrown it all away for this pathetic being. Provided for me? Are you insane? You've destroyed our family. You've killed other vampires all over some prophecy that we barely understand. No more. I'm done with you. You will not touch him. So, I see this dragon has fangs. Your voice drips with the venom of your mother's influence. How alike you've become. No. Because unlike her, I'm not afraid of you. Not anymore. And you. It appears I have you to thank for turning my daughter against me. I knew it was only a matter of time before she'd return with hatred in her heart. A small price to pay for the betterment of our kind. Yes, yes. Always the noble vampire hunter. And what happens when you've slain me? Is Valerica next? Is Serana? Then my daughter is truly lost. She died the moment she accepted a mortal into her life. Yes, quite. I'm growing weary of speaking to you and my traitorous daughter. I'll give you a single chance to turn over the bow to me. There will not be a second. Very well then, you leave me no choice.
Well, now that's done. I'm not sure. I'll probably stay with the Dawn Guard for as long as they'll let me. They're respectable fighters, and I think they see the benefits of having a vampire on their side now. Of course, if you've got any more adventures planned... That's what I wanted to hear. So... The... It's over. He's dead. And the prophecy dies with him. I... I suppose this is difficult for you. I think my father really died a long time ago. This was just... the end of something else. I did what needed to be done. Nothing more. I think perhaps... I think you did more than that. You have my thanks. <laughs>